Hey what up Street Talks, there came from there come Street Star Blog. So I wanna do a random video with y'all on how to be inspired and motivated while being stuck indoors. So some uh, some fun little ideas. So first and foremost, like if you have a digital camera, it seems kind of like a fun activity or a fun assignment to just kind of fuck around with all the filters. So I'm doing this one thing where it's like anything that's orange that's the selective color and everything else turns black and white so take a look at my gym my apartment everything is normal color or black and white except that orange ass wall and also it is very convenient that human pigment is also orange so uh so that's that's kind of fun so I'm doing this video because, you know, all this crazy shit going on right now. So there's so many different ways that you could be creative. Uh, let me just kind of share with them. So, you know, if you have a digital camera or you got your iPhone, just go through all the filters and experiment with all the filters and see what they do. Shoot a video, shoot a vlog, shoot photos. You know, just kind of play with stupid filters and just kind of like see where it takes you. So that's, that's one idea. Another idea is you know, start your own YouTube channel. I mean, you're stuck indoors, but at least you have access to the internet, so you're actually in pretty good shape. Um, so, you know, if you don't have it already, just download YouTube to your phone. If you have a Gmail account or any Google account, which everyone does, just uh, download the YouTube app in the top right corner, just upload your videos, and you know, you can start blogging or vlogging on anything you find interesting. So that's, that's one thing you do. Uh, another thing you could do is, you know, curate your photos. To curate your photos is also a creative act. So look through all your photos and choose your best photos. I personally like to do this thing called the small thumbnail test, which means look at all your photos based on your small thumbnails, and then based on that, determine, you know, kind of which image you prefer the best. And uh, other ideas, you know, you could kind of fuck around with uh, GarageBand. I actually really like to make my own beats at home. It's really fun, I put in, I just drag in the loops. Pretty simple, uh, other ideas. Start a website, start a blog. Uh, Bluehost.com, install wordpress.org if you want a free solution. Wordpress.com or medium.com are also good options. Uh, some other ideas is, you know, uh, start making illustrations draw like if you have a piece of paper and a pen or a, you know, pencil, crayons, you know, allow yourself to be a kid, start drawing again. Um, writing is obviously a creative act, writing poems, fuck around with like haiku poems. That's uh, kind of fun. Write your own little freestyle raps. That's kind of fun. Uh, other things you could do is uh, do a photography selfie project. And once again, all these creative things you do at home or making art at home, like you don't gotta, you know, share it with nobody. You could just do it for yourself. And I think this is kind of a, a very liberating thought because there's, you know, this thought that social media kind of conquers our world. You could do it kind of in isolation. Um, there's so many different things you could do. Uh, other things you could do is you could, um, you know, Take photos you've already shot and kind of play around with them in Photoshop. I, I like use Procreate on my iPad, draw on top of them, inverse your images, blur your photos, uh, play around with Photoshop. This is another tip too in Photoshop. Choose one photo you really like of your own and apply, experiment with all the filters available in Photoshop and just kind of see what it does. But anyways, there's a quadrillion things that you could do. Create a wall home. Use this opportunity maybe to create more digital art and just kind of have fun and don't take it too seriously.